Hello. This short film constitutes a continuation of the previous short demo. Here we will go over several basic uses of the Babylon software. Babylon running on the computer, this can be seen in two places. The Babylon icon on the taskbar, next to the computer clock, and the Babylon globe, which floats around at the top. The use of Babylon is most intuitive. The most popular use is a click on the word which we wish to translate. In my case, the Babylon click is control plus right mouse button on the queried word or phrase. The Babylon window is displayed according to my preferred language. It displays translation and definition results for queried terms. The preferred language is displayed and can be changed here. For example, if I change the language to Italian, then the results displayed by Babylon will be focused on the Italian speaker. F10 is the default shortcut. An empty Babylon window opens automatically so that you can type a word for translation in the term box. Another possibility is using the globe. Hovering over the globe with the mouse offers many assisting tools and usage functions. Translate web translator, speller, and units converter. A click on translate or units converter opens the Babylon window respectively. In addition, the globe rotates when one or more of the features become relevant. When I surf the net in a language other than mine and I decide to mark a certain text, the globe rotates. When the mouse hovers over the globe, it will open and the most relevant feature will be emphasized, in this case the translate. A click on translate will produce a translation result. If I indicate or mark a number, the globe will emphasize the units converter feature. When I will require the translation of the full web page I am perusing, I will click on Web Translator. I hope that this basic explanation assisted you in getting started with Babylon. Enjoy your Babylon!